We are here in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania to understand the healthcare infrastructure. It's large cities, big city, more than 5 million. And to visit one of our key customers. So Amana is a regional hospital that is supporting around 1 million people and they have about 24,000 HIV uh, patients who are attending there. We are receiving new patients yes. from four to eight per day. That's quite a number. Yeah, of course, quite a number. Yeah. Do you do counseling first or how no, does it work? This is the place. This is the place. Yeah, and also is you dispense yeah, drugs here, yeah, so, so you enroll patients into treatment here. Yeah, so exactly. Yeah, one yeah, stop for everything. For everything. HIV in general is a big problem in sub-Saharan Africa. In the southern part of Tanzania is up to 11%. So there are some hot spots. Yeah, yeah. yeah. BD is the first company worldwide introduced flow cytometer to do CD4 counting in Africa. Well, CD4 is a, is a cell that uh, is usually targeted by HIV virus. And uh, when the CD4 is uh, low, that means your immune system is uh, it's weak and uh, you're prone to so many opportunistic infections. When I got CD4 in 2007, it means So by measuring CD4 counts in HIV positive patients, we quickly can assess the immune system of that person before putting the patients on treatment. We have to a fax caliber, and now we have introduced to fax presto. Fax presto is a new technology. It's very easy to use. The design itself, the touch screen, the videos, onboard videos. It has also hemoglobin. That's very critical measurement. In addition, we can collect sample from finger prick. The whole day compare The incubation is 18 minutes and running of the sample is two minutes. So a patient can come in, get tested and go home with medication. I remove like this. This is still working. Most of the patients who are served in this type of setting, so they are not from the city. If you ask them to come back to get results in three days or a week later, most of the time you lose one third to half of the patients because of all other priorities in their life. We can see the difference. This is a very, very small lab. They do basic testing, HIV, TB, malaria. As you can see, the, the Fax Presto here is running on a battery. Also, you can see the reagent, the cartridge. Uh, it doesn't need to be refrigerated. How many patients should get here in this lab? Around 5-0-50 a day. Here now, the patients can uh, give blood in 30 minutes, they have the results. This perfect example of increasing access to resource limited settings and bringing the testing near patients. <laughs> And it's really, really helping patients, millions of patients in Africa. And we should all be proud of what we're doing and knowing that we're making a difference.